Let's go. Alright, Dad out here, CTSF Ains. And uh, I have my signature gun over here, the sniper. And I'm doing a review for it. This here is the Mauser Pro SR Pro Tactical. Came in the box. Just want to let you guys know, this gun came not put together. The upper receiver in the barrel was one piece, and the lower receiver in the stock was another piece, and the scope came in a box. So, it took me about an hour to put together. It comes with Allen wrenches and screwdrivers and anything you would need to put together. But yeah, so, it's got about 574 FPS with 0.12 grams, about 450 with 0.2 grams. It came with a small bag of these kind of BBs, 0.2. Uh, a speed loader with a small attachment so you can load the uh, magazine, which you have to pull back and load it like this. It's kind of hard to do. Uh, the scope is 3 to 9 by 40 times zoom. came with a lens cover. That took about an hour and a half to uh, sight in to make it pretty accurate. This thing shoots about 90 yards, I would say. So, pretty long range. The, it has an adjustable cheek piece where you rest. But uh, I lost a screw so it doesn't really stay in for my adjustable stock with this wheel here. Over on this side. It's got sling attachments. It came with a sling, but do not use it. It says, uh, when I ordered it, I got it on shortyusa.com, but you can get it on pretty much any website. Don't use a sling. It's a very low quality, and it will snap under the rifle weight. A bolt here. Cock it. There's the safety selector here. A uh, bipod that you can just slide in. It does, they do, oh, oh crap. Both legs do go in and out. Bipod just has to go by then. Usually it doesn't happen, but it's kind of resting on it. And then I moved it. So this is a good gun altogether. It was about $200, so not that expensive for an airsoft sniper. And I'm going to shoot it. I have different uh, range targets set up. A bipod, you can also adjust the length by unscrewing this and uh, moving these in and out. It has an adjustable hop up near the magazine a little screw in there it's kind of hard to see place the magazine in hand like this you pull this to release the mag alright shoot at those pesky bottles over there it is a pretty accurate gun. Just if you can see, they're going just to the left, or just to the right. So if this was a person, it would be hitting him. I'm going to shoot at that uh, milk carton down there. Once again, oh, there we go. That's a hit. And if you could, if you can see, there's a green electrical box all the way across the street, and there's uh, 
spray bottle on top of it, but two years. Kind of hard to get, but uh, I have hit the green electrical box before, just not very accurately. So I'm not guaranteeing to hit here, but it can be suspended. I think that actually might have hit the bottom. Alright, so yeah, I definitely recommend getting this gun. You can adjust the scope distance here and to set it in, there's an up and down thing on the scope that you need a screwdriver. It comes with the scope in the USA. In Europe it doesn't. It comes with scope rings and you can also put uh, other sights on it because it has rails. So, this is Deadeye, CT Airsoft Kings, Mambo working the camera. So, peace.